When Holger Rune came to Paris, Chad, he was 0 for 2 in terms of majors. Now he's in a quarterfinal, and he took out Stefano Tsitsipas on the way. Yeah, I think that really showed that he's ready for the moment and ready to at least take on the challenge of beating the big names, the more experienced players. This will be a bit of a tougher matchup um, against Rude, who just understands how to play on the clay, understands how to create angles. But I think for Rune, you know, he's got to keep that same mindset that he's had, being aggressive, taking it to Rude. The fact that they played a lot tighter in that last meeting, I think that should help. You know, it's always a learning experience when you're at this age. And, and you know, in this stage, I think he's learning very quickly. And certainly, maybe it's right in time for this match, for him to really, you know, make a match of it and maybe pull off another upset. The discerning American tennis fan might remember that Rune played at the U.S. Open, and he distinguished himself for two reasons. One, he had an Ikea bag, so loyal to his Scandinavian roots, but he brought an Ikea bag onto the court. He also played a very nice match against Novak Djokovic. Remember, Djokovic thought the crowd was booing. They were saying Rune. But this is the guy who's played the number one player in the world on a big stadium court. So he may have just turned 19, but he's already shown he can play at this level, and he will not be awed, I don't think by the circumstances tonight. He has a ton of confidence. He has said from a very early age, I want to be number one in the world, and I believe that I can get there. He would be the first teenager to get to the Final Four here at Roland Garros.